Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new episode of Spike Reviews. I'm Spike, your host, and most of you guys aren't subscribed, I've noticed, that watch my videos. It's completely free, super easy. Just hit that subscribe button, completely free, and it helps me a lot. All right, let's get into this review. So I was walking down Central Market the other day to get some Waterloo sparkling water. I'm obsessed with that stuff. And this caught my eye. And it caught my son's eye and I had to buy it immediately because it reminded me of a certain somebody. This guy, right here specifically. Old man Luke Skywalker. And the reason I bring that up and the reason I'm wearing the Luke shirt as well is because I found blue milk. Yeah, blue milk. Now, I don't know how bright it stands out in camera right now, but it is very, very blue. And it immediately reminded me of Luke Skywalker. So I found the famous Star Wars blue milk. And what makes it blue, you might ask? It is cotton candy flavored. Cotton candy flavored milk. Now, it's been sitting in my fridge for a week because I just haven't had the time to review it. Luckily, it doesn't expire until the 27th. I don't know when I'm going to upload this video but it doesn't expire to the 27th. All right, con candy flavored milk. Now, I'm not a fan of whole milk to begin with because I'm kind of like lactose, just a little bit lactose. So uh, this should be interesting. All right, brought a glass. Let's uh, crack this bad boy open. How do you open this? I guess it has a little seal right here. I'm curious as to what it's gonna smell like. Hopefully it has a very strong con candy smell. But we'll see, I guess. Ooh. The bottle is really cool. I might keep the bottle. Thick glass bottle. Really retro, old school. Alright, let's smell this. Yeah. Kinda smells like cotton candy. Just a little bit. And I just noticed this glass is dirty. Let me clean it real quick. Hold on. All right, let's pour ourselves a uh, nice hearty glass of con candy milk. Now the company is called Chateau, Chateau, Shadow, Shadow Milk Company. Forgot to mention that. And uh, they pride themselves in having no hormones in their milk. Very natural and it is good for your family apparently, is what it says on the back. Don't know much about this company, but uh, it just caught my eye so I bought it. All right, let's uh, pour. It's a little thick, jeez. It's not spoiled, is it? Nope. Should still be good for another six days. All right. Here it is. The cotton candy milk. It is very viscous. It's thick. It's coating the glass. That's pretty wild. All right. I'm kind of nervous. All right. Cheers to cotton candy milk. Interesting, not bad. <laughs> All right, one more sip for science and myself because this is pretty good. That's really tasty. I was not expecting it to be that good, to be honest. I was very skeptical, but man, that is so good. My son's gonna love this. He, uh, he didn't want to try it. He wanted to wait for me to review it before he tries it. So this is all his now. And he's probably going to love it. As I love it. Randomly. It's so good. Alright. It does taste like cotton candy right up front. It's very sweet. Creamy. More viscous than your average whole milk for sure. Um, it tastes kind of like... What does it remind me of? It reminds me of kind of like a, a milkshake in liquid form. Like a very melted, uh, very melted uh, milkshake is what it reminds me of. It's good. This is more like a dessert than your average milk. One more little sip because I have other products to review and this is just not going to clash well. I can already see this coming. All right. One more little sip. That's good. All right. I'm not a milk connoisseur. I don't drink whole milk. But... This is definitely going to be an exception and I'm going to have to give Chateau Milk, Cotton Candy Milk, the famous blue milk, a solid 9 out of 10. Now for me to give a milk product a 9 out of 10 is crazy and that just goes to show you just how good this product is. 
They also have root beer flavored and caramel, I believe. And now I have to go back and get that root beer flavored milk. I have to do it. I hope it's as good as this, because dang. So if you're at Central Market one day and you stumble across the dairy aisle and you see this, buy it. It's definitely worth it. It's uh, six bucks, a little pricey, but you get a nice glass bottle and a cool novelty and a delicious drink. So worth it? I think so. All right, guys, for another episode of Spike Reviews. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the little bell so you're notified every time I drop a brand new video. Be kind to each other, wash your hands, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.